Good afternoon, everyone. I am in Elmhurst, and today is Friday, and I am going to a hair salon in Elmhurst to do a little digital perm on my hair. So I'm taking you along with me. It is going to be a solo episode today, or solo video today, because Ben is at work, and I have spring break today. That's well, it's spring break this week. Today is the last day of the spring break since it's a Friday. Um, so yeah, that's why I have time to go out and do something for my hair. <laughs> so I am going to go to this small salon called New Best Haircut Salon. New Best Cut Hair Salon. I think yes and it is right next to the Walgreens in Elmhurst I've been there once before to get a haircut last year and it was not bad well it's just like a regular haircut I don't really I guess have too much high expectations when I get haircuts because it's just kind of a trim and then it kind of looks the same except it's shorter <laughs> Unless I go for like a drastic cut. That's the thing about girls' hairs. <laughs> girls' haircuts. Sometimes you don't even notice that they get a haircut. <laughs> or guys, you can tell because because they get the haircuts like every two weeks. But for girls, you can kind of get away with having <laughs> one haircut a day. No, not a day. One haircut a year. Yeah, so I'm so excited to get a digital perm. Today, it's been too long. Um, I've gotten digital perms twice already. Once in 2017 and once in 2019. And now again in 2021. So it seems like I get it every two years. Digital perms, they say it lasts like maybe six months or so. but. For me, it lasts longer, usually, because I kind of cut my hair short and let it grow out, and the perms, they do get looser towards the end of its life, <laughs> um, but it still looks good, and then you truly, truly get rid of it when you chop it all off. Yep. So I am excited to get another perm. Oh, a digital perm is um, like curls for your hair. So a perm is, perm is a curl for your hair. Oh, so right now I'm just walking down Broadway all the way straight down for about 15 minutes and then I'll reach the hair salon. There's many different types of perms. There's um, cold perm, aka I think that's called a regular perm, which is when um, basically when your hair is wet, it looks like the curls are very tight and the, the curls are more prominent when your hair is wet. And when your hair dries up, it becomes loose and less prominent. And the opposite, well that's, so that's for wet. No, that's for cold perm, which is regular perm. Now, the opposite is true for a digital perm, where, um, where if your hair is oh yeah sorry <laughs> lost my train of thought there <laughs> um so yeah so digital perm is where you, when your hair is wet it's a little harder to see the curls but when it dries up you see the curls 
digital, digital perms are more expensive, a little bit more, but it is awesome. It's good for your hair. I'm also gonna get the haircut and deep treatment as well, just so the hair stays as healthy as it can throughout this process. This is like um, our third or fourth um, hers video, I know. Well, we come here pretty often. So I guess this video is more about me talking. <laughs> um, I'll show you the before and the after. Well, the before, for the before, you already know what my hair looks like <laughs> because when Ben holds the camera and I go in front of him you see that my hair is straight and half black and half brown and it just looks like um it looks like it could be better <laughs> for sure um, but I think with the curls in it it'll look like more Dimension three, di three D, three dimensional. It'll look like it help. It'll, it'll look like it'll have more volume <laughs> and depth, and it'll be funner. So I am excited. Yes. Okay. I should talk about some stuff we see, right? Okay. So that is the U.S. supermarket. My family and I used to go here super often the US supermarket and now there's so many around that we go to the one that's nearer to us or the one that has easiest parking um, I actually shopped in this supermarket last week though because they have a they have a parking lot sometimes it takes a little while to find a spot but you know it works because there's a lot. <laughs> ben and I came here last week as well. We ate at Akino Sushi, which is all you can eat sushi. It is delicious. It recently opened again, like beginning of March. They had closed for a few weeks, so then we ate at the pho restaurant next door to it. Pho Bak. BAC <laughs> um, and we were just checking their Instagram trying to find updates on when they were trying to open and right when they open well not right after they open but a few weeks after they open we decided to go to Akina it was delicious and usually for buffets I feel like we try to stuff ourselves and eat as much as we can well, I haven't done that in a long time. I just like eat a lot, but like not too much that I feel super uncomfortable after. But um, Ben does sometimes. Well, not this time. <laughs> we ate a good amount. We only got, we ate all that we ordered for the first round. And then for the second round, I think we all we only added one miso soup. <laughs> so no food waste there, and the sushi was delicious. A lot of avocado, very fresh avocado that filled us up. I'm almost there, the hair salon. But usually we walk on that street street down that's what today I walked across the street mm -hmm. down but yeah there is that and a cafe it's Joju is there bubble tea as well
one more block and then we'll see the hair salon. And then, so the digital perm takes over four hours. I think since I have long, thicker hair, it'll take maybe four and a half to five hours. So it's two o'clock now. So I hope I'll be done around seven and then get home for dinner and we'll see how the hair looks after. It's gonna be awesome. Okay, so I see it. It is the purple one there. <laughs> so yeah, it's the purple salon there and I'm gonna go get my hair done there. Okay, see you later. So I forgot to do a little before and after of my hair. So this is how it looks now. It's black. Everything is black up here and brown here. It looks kind of, it could look a lot better, right? For sure. Um, so yeah, this is before. And I'm gonna snap and then will see the after. After the snap. Just kidding, I can't snap, but yeah. Awesome. Okay, so it is seven forty. It's seven forty p.m. Just got out of the hair salon. So let's see. I got there around two oh five, and I finished around seven forty. So that was about five and a half hours. <laughs> yes. So it was five and a half hours, but they gave me the whole deal, the whole treatment and everything. I got the, the perm and a deep treatment, haircut. So I think if um, for just the digital perm part, that's probably only three hours. And then another 30 minutes for a haircut and another like 45 minutes for a treatment or something like that. I'm not sure. I also did some waiting <laughs> because they were really busy today. I went on a Friday and Friday, Saturday, Sundays, always super busy days. Yeah, got a massage. It was like 10 minutes long. <laughs> it was so nice. Back massage. I'm like out of breath <laughs> because I'm walking really fast home. Also, um, it's cold outside. But yeah, so th the sun is setting. Well, the sun just set so it's getting darker so um yeah I'll show you the hair later maybe Ben can hold the camera I'll show you the hair <laughs> I didn't do a before and after picture but I'll do a before and after video <laughs> yeah I think I, I like this because Usually my digital perms are kind of low. Like the perm is only only on the ends. And then this time he recommended me getting it like a little below my ears. So there's more curls. Yeah, I think it's gonna be good. I'm excited to see the result when my hair completely dries. I think it's gonna be great. <laughs> if this turns out well, Sharon's gonna come here to get her digital perm as well. 
and yeah, maybe another friend will come here to get color or balayage. I think that's how you pronounce it. Wow, the sky looks so blue on my screen. No filter. <laughs> Not the daytime cloudy sky blue, but it's like a blue purple on my screen. I spent so much time on my phone today just looking down on my screen. Too much time. My screen time is going to be so high for today. <laughs> Usually my screen time is about four and a half hours per day. So today I spent four, four and a half hours on my phone in the salon plus the amount of time that I spent this morning and tonight. So screen time is going to be a lot today. <laughs> Tomorrow, tomorrow, Ben and I have a bigger client than we usually do for the food photography. Usually we uh, work with clients that have one to like a handful of locations, but this one is kind of like a chain. It is a chain, but it is independently owned. and. Yeah, we're going to work together for a photo shoot. So it's very exciting because instead of just putting it on social media like Instagram Reels, they might run ads on it. Well, they will run ads on it. Probably on Facebook, Instagram. So it's kind of more professional. <laughs> so Ben stated that he was a little nervous and this has to be like really good quality, but I don't doubt that he would do a great job. We got, well, when we started um, food photography, it was just that, the photography part. But then Ben started to want to make reels, so videos. And we got so many people wanting to partner up and collab with us. because of the reels I think so <laughs> reels is really big now and it's getting us a lot of clients so maybe I should brush up on my video making skills <laughs> usually I kind of just put it together and put like a little transition in the beginning and end but Ben does some some cool things with his reels if you haven't seen them you can check them out on our Instagram at the Bing Buzz <laughs> everything is at the Bing Buzz but yeah very proud of those videos and a lot of clients like them too Yeah. All right, so I am going to uh, pause the park. No, pause the video here. And then we'll pick up when we're indoors and then show you how the hair looks like in the brighter light. So see ya. Welcome to my bathroom. <laughs> The lighting is better in here than my back bedroom, but this is how the perm came out. This is back. Usually my perm isn't this high, but my hair is also not this long. So this is all different. <laughs> light? Good. Okay. Anyway, yeah, I think it will look better when it's um, dry, so. See you in the next video. <laughs> so my hairdresser, hair 
stylist, hair curler person. Uh, his name is Sam, and he was so patient. He also got me this, uh, recommended this treatment curler cream to me. Oh, Lisa. <gasps> okay, yeah, so you use this after you wash your hair, you just kind of wash your hair, then have a pump, and then go like this. So yeah, this will keep the hair perm longer. So yeah, hope you enjoy this little vlog kind of video, and I'll see ya next time.